So welcome to day 3 of understanding how LMs work. So in our last video, we covered how words get chopped into pieces through tokenization and explored byte pair encoding. So if you haven't watched those, mm -hmm. go and watch them for better understanding of this video. So in our last video, we learned that once a word is broken down, each token gets a unique numerical ID. You can see that in action by using OpenAI's tokenizer. So what are these token IDs? So today, we are going to explore the magic behind this, the embeddings. But before all that, we all know that computer only understand numbers. And that's the reason why LLMs uses tokenization and BPE in order to convert text into numbers. But still they can't understand their meaning. It's like having a phone book with just names and no addresses. It doesn't even know how they relate or where they belong. Imagine you have a big box of colorful blocks. Right now, each block has their own words with number like 5, 28 or 101. These are like token IDs that we saw earlier. So let's say if you are a child and I asked you to build something cool out of those blocks, then you probably can't do it as well until you understand them. LLMs also face same kind of problem. Embeddings give LLM the power to understand them. So let's see how it works by taking an example. So to understand their meaning, we give each block a list of power scores. Let's say our scores are based on masculinity, royalty, food and action. Let's say the block 5 has a word king. The score for that will be royalty as 9 out of 10, masculinity 8 out of 10, food 1 out of 10. The second block has a word queen. For this, the score would be royalty 9 out of 10, masculinity 1 out of 10, food 1 out of 10. Let's say the third block is apple. We score it as royalty 0 out of 10, masculinity 0 out of 10, food 9 out of 10. This list of power scores is the embeddings. It gives the boring token ID a rich meaning. By comparing these scores, LLM can now see that king and queen are very similar and should be grouped together, while apple belongs to a separate section. You can see this division in action using TensorFlow's embedding projector. This is how an LLM is trained to understand the meaning behind different words. It doesn't just know the words, it understands how they connect to each other based on their powers or embeddings. So that's it for now. In our next video, we'll see about attention mechanism the logical step after embeddings. Subscribe to my channel so you can't miss it.